what's going on youtube welcome to the channel thanks for checking out the channel and if you're new to the channel make sure you hit that like button and hit the subscribe button and hit the notify button where we're always dropping new toyota tacoma content all right guys yeah so the 2023 toyota tacoma guys should you get one of these trucks so i know you know we've been doing nothing but 2024 toyota tacoma content but um i'm just like man what about the people that just bought a 2023 you know i mean you got your truck you know maybe a couple months ago maybe a month ago maybe two weeks ago or maybe four months ago so you know there's plenty of content on these trucks on on youtube online and and things like that but these things are really really awesome and um i've been driving my truck the last couple of days i got the oil changed recently and these trucks are just awesome i mean this truck rides so smooth it looks good it just it looks amazing it just looks great so I have no complaints about this truck. I mean, it just looks awesome. The best thing you can do to these trucks is go ahead and slap on a new set of tires is the first thing you should do. So like, if you're kind of getting a little bored with your truck and maybe you haven't even done anything to it, you haven't even put any wheels, tires, grab you a new set of wheels and tires is the first thing I would recommend you do. Like I didn't have to grab the, uh, the, the wheels because the TRD Pro comes on awesome little 16 inch wheels. I will upgrade to a 17 inch wheel at some point, but um, no, this truck is just awesome. Let's look at this Chevy. But yeah, this truck is awesome. You know what I'm saying? This truck is great. The third gens are awesome. It's just something about them. They, they look so good. I mean, to me, this Pro looks good. So you got a good motor. You got the last naturally aspirated V6 if you got one of these. If you got a 2023 or if you have from 2016 on up, you know, this is the best truck, you know. This is the best Tacoma probably so far. Now, my uh, my brother-in-law has a second gen. He's got that 4.0. He's got over 200 some thousand miles on that truck. And he says it just drives like it's brand new. And he listed a couple things that's wrong with it and he's still driving it. You know, like things that are like on their way going out, but he's still driving it, still hauling stuff. And uh, yeah, and that's the gen two. But these gen threes, I mean, this, this looks good. Like I said, this is a pro, this is solar octane. But uh, if you have a third gen Tacoma from 2016 to 2023, they're basically gonna be the same style if you have a four x four. So even if you don't have a four x four, you can have a four x two and it's gonna have the same body style. But to me, yeah, I just came out. I've been looking at 2024s, doing tons and tons and tons of videos. And it just kind of crossed my mind as I was looking at my truck and just saying, you know, how beautiful it is. I just, I just love the heck out of this truck. And it's got enough tech for me. So like if you got, you know, one of these trucks, I mean, half the new trucks, you ain't even going to get a power seat. So you got a power seat. You're, you're not going to have one in the passenger. You know, they got the baby seat back there, but we're going to get a power sliding window. You know, so we're going to get some things. And most of the most of the third gens, if you got a sport or off road, you got the integrated uh, turn signal. OK, and there's so many mods and things that you can do with these trucks. There's so many, uh, so many mods and aftermarket parts that people have been doing for years. We're having a beautiful day out here. Look at those clouds. Crazy, huh? Yeah, so we're having a beautiful day out here. We got the flag in the back, repping America. America, America. But uh, yeah, guys, so the third gens is where it's at, you know? I love the rumble that I hear out of my truck. It just, it feels so smooth, you know? Ride down these BF. Good rich tires is just nice, but the, the tires definitely set it off. I'm looking to do more things to my truck. So I'm just really holding back. I really want to get the lift kit. So I, I'm probably going to do something. My next mod is either going to be that Westcott lift kit for it. So I can use my existing um, Fox suspension all the way around and lift it up. And then we'll put some bigger tires on it because it needs to have 285. So this truck, like, I don't want to get rid of my truck. I probably I probably never will. I love the way that these new ones look. So we'll just bring you over here to a new one real quick. I love the way these ones look. You know, here's a Barcelona Red. They look good. I think they might even, you know, we'll go to the front end. I think they might even look better than my truck. You know, as far as it looks. But far as, like, sound and, you know... My truck looks good still, but these trucks look awesome too. There's just, it's just a little bit more futuristic. Now you might not even like the way the new truck looks. You might not like how it looks. And we'll just jump into a price real quick for you guys, because this one is a four x four. So you're looking at $43,000 for an SR5, but that's how they look, you know? 
so we've done plenty of that stuff so people are buying these these are sitting on the lot and they got just a couple couple over here for sale you know they got about three or four of them but not very many but so you just seen that but this is just a classic look to me i mean these trucks look so good i've seen several of them today i haven't even told you about that i've seen several of them because you're going to see them because the third gen is there's a million of them so i've seen several of these lifted today and that's why i really want to get mine lifted do the lift and then i want the trd cold air intake but i need the lift and put it on 285s just to, just so you know you guys can see it you know how it's supposed to be properly but i mean this thing looks really good like this so i have it um i went up a size on the tire so the stock size is 265 70 r16 and i went to 265 75 r16 and you should be able to run that on any of the pros and you should be able to run that on your stock off-road or sport without a lift but this is definitely the highest tire size you can go with the pro and i really want to hold on to my truck because it's the last naturally aspirated six it's the um the last trd pro color on the um, third gen tacoma and it was the color of the year solar octane and the truck is just perfect it's just it's beautiful i mean even with the tires on it now it just still looks good i mean get you some ko2s i'm sorry i i'm really biased because I, i've had two sets of these and um i've had dirt tracks and that's basically it i've just had dirt tracks and i've had two sets of these and i've had these in 17 inch tires as well too but they just look so good they make your truck look so much better but and that's one thing too you know i've been getting in a lot of these uh trucks lately in the 24s and everything and just getting to my truck it's a lot higher you know having a lift you know the natural lift on the trd pro it sits you up higher and then having the you know the little bumped up size and the tires i feel like i'm i'm getting up into the truck you know where these other trucks i'm feeling like i'm going down you know they're not really high looking you know some of these ones looked a little bit higher earlier today but um no the third gen is where it's at i mean this is fully loaded you get everything everything with the pro so you're going to get the camera now you can get basically like if you get a, a off-road premium was the last truck that i had was a trd off-road and army green off-road premium and i threw the trd lift kit on it so i had the camera i had the whole exact setup on here except you know the fox suspension i had a camera i had the sunroof and i had the leather had the bed lights yeah these things are solid man these things are just good looking i mean like that's why you guys like if maybe i'm not even going to say that because if i would have any any of these third gens i mean you hook your truck up they're going to look good so that's why i said i want to really get my truck lifted and get it on the bigger wheels and tires so then when i do see the lifted 24s we can just be like okay yeah let's 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 see them because when those 24s get lifted and they put the bigger wheels and tires on them they look good but nothing looks better than a third gen i mean this is just a classic body style and there's so many things you can do with these trucks and as of right now you know they just got a better track record you know we don't know enough about the 2024s and like i said i hope the 2024s work out and i hope they're great but as of right now i just wouldn't i couldn't trade i couldn't trade for nothing right now because to me it's not worth it you know i would have to have a pro for a pro so that's what we'll see and i think even then it'll be hard so we'll see what i can do because like i said in this video i really want to hold on to this truck you know so like if you got a favorite color of one of these third gens and you got the color you want and you got every option on your truck and you know you might want to hold on to these last naturally aspirated v6s you know they'll be around but people are going to buy them and they just look awesome like like when i pulled up i was like you know what i'm gonna do a video because my truck just looks it just looks so good you know i got the flag in the background it just it just looks really really good it just looks like he almost looks out of place over here so yeah to me i'm gonna try to hold on to him you know i really am because this solar octane is just it's something else you know but uh thanks for all the love you guys been showing the channel so i just felt like you guys needed a video i felt like our third gen guys we needed a video because you know everybody's you know we're getting all the views people are getting all the views for the fourth gen and that's just how it is youtubers are going to buy them and stuff but i'm like no i got me i got my truck and you guys are like do not get rid of it i'm not getting rid of it i like the fourth gens but like i said it's going to take a lot it's going to have to make a lot of financial sense for me to get rid of this and the tesla but i might be holding on to it like i said even if i i like the fourth gens you know I, I like how they look but this truck is awesome and i just can't get rid of it <laughs> i just can't but uh yeah that's gonna do it guys have a good day and God bless. Thanks for checking out the channel. 
And if you got a third gen, you got an awesome truck. You know, these trucks are gonna run forever. So you don't have nothing to worry about. So if you just bought you a 2023, don't even worry about no 2024. Let them work out all the bugs and let's see what other colors and options we get in the next couple of years. And let's see if the prices go down. Mostly, let's see if those prices go down. So yeah, people aren't ne definitely not jumping ship, you know, to go get something with a lot less options. So thanks a lot for checking out the channel. You guys have a good day and God bless. Peace.